It's been six months since the worst crash in the history of Air France. Yet flight accident investigators are still unable to explain why flight AF447 came down. All 216 passengers and 12 crew were killed when the Airbus A330 crashed into the Atlantic on June the 1st, en route from Rio de Janeiro to Paris. Recovery teams trawled parts of the ocean for weeks afterwards in the hope of locating the plane's black boxes, flight recorders that could hold the key to why the plane crashed in mid-flight. But the search was in vain. Uh, which one? The black boxes have not been found, the black boxes have not been located. We are still looking for the black boxes. Search teams eventually retrieved around 50 bodies from the sea, along with some thousand pieces of debris. Those parts of the aeroplane that were found were taken to the Aeronautics Testing Centre in Toulouse in the south of France to be analysed. Experts hope they'll provide some clues as to what caused the accident. All these bits of debris which we've retrieved from the crash, we're going to try to reassemble them as they would have been on the plane to see how they fit together now. From there, we'll be able to figure out if the plane disintegrated in mid-air or on impact with the sea. So far, investigators are convinced that faulty speedometers or pitot tubes were a factor in the crash, but don't believe they were the only cause. French crash investigation agency, the BEA, admitted on Sunday that they're still at a loss as to why the plane went down. The lack of information and the length of time the inquiry is taking has angered the families of those who died. We don't know what happened to the plane, we don't know why it crashed, um, we haven't been able to find the plane or the black boxes uh, and consequently very few of the bodies were found. It makes it a very difficult situation for people to, for families um, to have closure, to, to accept the loss of their loved one and I think many of the families uh, suffer from, from this. The BEA is releasing a report on Thursday recommending that flights be tracked by satellite, meaning they can be traced even in areas without radar. The search efforts for the AF-447 has been severely hampered because it went down in a blackout zone. Meanwhile, the focus of the investigation is shifting to ocean science. Experts are studying currents and underwater topography to calculate where the wreckage of the AF-447 might be before sonar and robot submarines start a new three-month search in February.